Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June the 13th of 2021, well it is titled a supercell thunderstorm over Texas. So what do we see here? Well, this is going to be a video clip that we will look at and it will show the development and end of a supercell thunderstorm. So a much larger type of thunderstorm that we get. And these are the ones that you're used to seeing that will cause tornadoes. So when you see a tornado warning and watch, that's because often because of cells like this that are developing. We'll also get hail and things that are associated with this and extremely heavy rain. So we'll get to see this and let's go ahead and play the video to start. And as you watch it, what you'll get to see is the material starting to swirl around and you'll note that it swirls around the area uh, where it has been developing. And as you'll note you'll also see some lightning up towards the top as the storm develops and watching down towards the bottom you'll even see material being picked up off the ground as dust begins to swirl around being picked up by the very strong winds that develop within the storm. So we can continue to see this. Now you're not watching the entire entire storm here, of course. We're seeing just a few little clips of this to watch and see how the development of the storm worked. So again, you can still see that lightning and you see very strong, well-developed spirals, spiral structures as they begin to swirl upward through this area. And then finally, as the rain start towards the end, as the storm slowly starts to die out. Now storms like this are of course quite common on Earth as we do get them uh, on a regular basis each year and in fact quite common in what is called Tornado Alley of the United States. Uh, of course storms are also common elsewhere in the solar system so looking at this from an astronomical point of view here we're seeing a storm on the Earth but you can also see storms elsewhere. So we can see swirling storms that develop in, for example, the large planets. And the large planets have things like Jupiter's great red spot that also have great swirling storms. Not the exact same structure that we see here, but it is interesting to know how much of the things that we see here, like the uh, swirling storms and lightning, are also present on other planets. In fact, Mars also has great dust storms that can engulf the entire planet much more than any dust storm here on Earth. So many of the things that we see here and helping to understand them helps us to understand other planets and at the same point being able to understand other planets can help us to better understand the weather conditions and properties here on Earth. So that was our picture of the day for June the 13th of 2021. It was titled A Supercell Thunderstorm Over Texas. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Largest Moon Revisited. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.